Hi everybody, Melissa here. Welcome back if you are returning to my channel and if it's your first time here, welcome. I hope if you like this video that you will like, subscribe, leave a comment. I'll also leave my email down below. You can hit me up that way, would be great. And maybe a thumbs up. It's always kind of cool to get. Um, I just wanted to come out with a really quick video for with you guys of some things that I picked up at Target. Uh, Target, I haven't shopped at Target in so, so long, but I've been back in the Target kick lately. Um, I went when, when they got the Tabitha Brown. Uh, the Tabitha Brown I wanted to go and check out, so I went and I did check out the Tabitha Brown stuff and I got that first haul, which you've seen. Um, and then this here, I have a couple of things to share with you, is from the past two times at Target that I have picked up. Um, a lot of it is Tabitha Brown, but some of it's not. So I'm going to go ahead and share that with you guys right now. The first thing is um, I got these Tabitha Brown earrings. These are, if you can see the color there, it's kind of a marbleized looking green, like a forest green, um, but they're really light. They're really comfortable and I just thought they were perfect for summer. So I went ahead and picked these up. Um, then I went ahead and got this one outfit here, which is very loud, very right very in your face i didn't think my husband was gonna like it but he actually did um because he knows i love bright colors and he just said it was very me so i'm like yes gonna get it so i did and it is this tabitha brand you're gonna go oh wow that is bright but it is bright it is loud and it is so me um got the stretch top so you can wear it off the shoulder a little elastic and the arms at the waist brings it in and if you can't tell it's just a mixture of a kind of like an abstract design and lemons all over it so you got the top but if the top wasn't enough mm -hmm, I got the pants the pants have a straight front elastic back and it has a tie in the front Woo, right there and all of her things have pockets. I love pockets. Love, love, love. But these are a wide leg, very resort, poolside, cruise. Um, just, you're not going to be able to be a shrinking violet and hide in the corner in this outfit here. No, no. You're going to cha-cha, cha-cha, cha-cha with a little margarita or a little Diet Coke in your hand there. Really cute. Love it can't wait to wear it. I haven't worn it yet, obviously. The tags are still on it, but I thought, yeah, I'm going to break that out soon. Then I picked up, this is, this is not Tabitha Brown, but I'm going to show you. It's called, um, it's a brand Ava Viv, Ava and Viv. It's a cute little dress. This is the back of it, some stretch, but here's the front and it's, um, because of the elastic in the back, it's going to give you a nice, uh, stretch around here but it's form fitting so um, good for the girls little floppy arm here thin cotton material with a, a ruffle on the bottom I thought super cute it goes to my knees which I like because I don't like showing any of my legs whatsoever from the knees down I'm cool knees up no way not not gonna happen I'll wear bicycle shorts or anything to cover up thighage because the thighage is not going to be on display but um this is just an eight dollar t-shirt from target just to wear with um jeans with um leggings anything like that you know just to be comfortable i could even wear with the pants i have on right now would be great so i got that and then i picked up this top that i have on right now whoops there's the budge but um, it's meant to be off the shoulders. I just threw it on because I was doing this video to show you guys. And I like because it has this kind of a square neck or you can pull it off the shoulders. And then I'll show you. The back is also um, has that same neckline on it in the back. And I kind of like because sometimes I like to show my tattoos. Sometimes I don't. So, um, you know, if I want to show my tattoos and let people see them. I can wear something like this and share them with the world. Otherwise, I can be conservative and cover it up. So yeah, I'm gonna show you the outfit I have on because I do have on a pair of wide leg uh, Tabitha Brown pants that I had picked up 
which is kind of an abstract, and they were $30. This was $15, so my whole outfit is like $45, bucks. really cheap. And then for the shoes, I have, um, these are my Kurt Geiger rainbow pool slides that I have. Um, I have them on, just real comfortable around the house in the backyard. You can wash them, piece of cake. But Tabitha Brown has a line of hats. This is the hat right there. It was $25. It's just a straw hat, but it has some weaving design on here. And um, the thing I kind of don't like, which made me borderline wonder if I was going to take it back, is underneath here, you can see the, the embroidery. Oh, that kind of bothers me. I would kind of wish I didn't see that, but um, if I'm wearing it, I'm not going to see it, I hope. So, you know, we'll see. We'll pop it on here. See what she looks like. I'm thinking, you know, working in the yard, riding the mower, that kind of thing. Be awesome. Yeah, let's see. I'll get up and I'll show you my outfit I have on and with the hat. Let's see what you think. See if you can see me when I come over here. I'll move the chair. It's kind of bright back here, but these are the Tabitha Brown. You can see they're big and baggy, wide leg pants. I probably should have got a size smaller. And then I got um, this top that I'll make Tabitha Brown hat. And the back of the top there. Ta-da! What do you guys think? I'll have to play with the hat, but I think for in the backyard and sitting in the sun, reading a book, riding the John Deere mower, it'd be kind of cute. Yeah, and you know, starting to grow on me. Yeah, I think so. So um, other than that, I got a sample of the Burberry Her fragrance, and I have it on right now, and I'm kind of grooving on it. It's kind of got this uh, red berry scent to it. I haven't looked at the notes to see what's in it, but it kind of smells like a raspberry, strawberry, floral, with some sweetness to it, but maybe a little vanilla in there too. I have it on and I can, I'm just smelling it lofting up and I've had it on for a little bit, so it, it has soaked into my skin. Um, but it smells really, really good. Tell me if you have it and if you love it, but also, um, I'm really curious about the Burberry, um, the Her Intense version. I haven't seen it anywhere. I've looked for it and haven't been able to find it. I could probably find it online, but I just wondered what uh, your guys' opinion is. If you have it, share with me. Tomorrow I'll be receiving a new fragrance. I'm going to be getting the um, So Scandal. So we'll see what we think of that. I have a feeling I'm probably gonna like it because it has some more of the berry scents in there. I said this video wasn't gonna be too long and here I am, I'm just gabbing, gabbing, gabbing. It's kind of like what I do, right? Yeah, but I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. If you have weather like this, go outside. I hope you can enjoy it for a minute or two or an afternoon, soak up some sun. And I did yesterday when I was mowing, I little bit on my back there but that's all I wanted to share with you guys today let you know I'm thinking of you and I'll see you guys real soon bye